Uh, so welcome back guys. My name is Amlan and in today's Make Much Free campaign, we go about looking at how we can fix WhatsApp notification not showing on an Android phone. Now I have the Samsung M51 here, I have the Samsung phone here, I have WhatsApp on both phones installed. Trying to send a WhatsApp to my Samsung M51 on this phone, from this phone. So I send a message and you can see I don't have any notification appearing here on home screen. Neither on home screen, neither on lock screen, so I don't get any message. So like what do I do when I don't get WhatsApp notifications? So this tutorial is exactly for that. Now let's look at a few settings that we need to initially have on our phone. Now first things first, ensure that the aeroplane mode is not turned on. Again ensure that there is no power mode or ultra data saving mode. Nothing of this sort has been enabled because if any of this has been enabled it prevents notifications from being sent in order to preserve energy and now let's begin now there are a few things that we need to do first here under the samsung phone swipe on the top tap on the grid you reach to the settings panel scroll down until you see notifications tap on notifications we need to first check whether notifications have been enabled for the app itself so for that like i need to tap on more here so this is basically all my system as well as mobile apps so here whatsapp you can see the notifications have not been turned on i will simply toggle this to on and then check for the uh, different notifications within whatsapp so i need to enable all of this so you can see chat failure other notifications sending media all of this should be enabled now there are two things here this is at the uh, system level itself that i am enabling the notifications so in case this is not enabled there is no way that the app notifications uh, within the app will actually work so this is in app notification settings this is the next level so when i tap on this this is within whatsapp the different notifications that are permitted so within whatsapp what are the notifications for messages does this have a ringtone attached to it do i want it to vibrate if yes then if will it be a short one or a long one then again do i want to have a light color or something like that then like different things like this is for messages, reaction notifications, high priority notifications. Do you want notifications for groups? If you want a different uh, ringtone, you can give it here. You can customize this. Then again, vibration. Do you want vibration? Do you want light? And all of this similarly for calls and like again, a ringtone and a vibration. Also ensure that the volume on this mobile is like turned on. You should not be muting it. Otherwise, like when you get the notifications you won't be able to hear them so these are a few little things that you can do again like this can be done from the app level also so i can actually head towards the whatsapp application here head towards like the settings inside settings i can head towards notifications and i get the same page here so that is why it's called in app notifications but do understand that the in app notifications will not work until unless you have set the app notifications in the first place so if the app notifications at the system level have not been turned on then the in-app notifications won't work at all so just ensure that that thing is done next within notifications uh, i mean you need to come down so i will just head towards notification come down i will ensure that do not disturb is not turned on the way do not disturb works is it will not allow for uh, notifications and therefore you don't want do not disturb to be turned on so you want it to be turned off so once this is done another thing is that many people complain that they don't get the notifications on the lock screen so head towards the lock screen and ensure that the notifications is turned on this should not be turned off it should be turned on and if it is showing icons also have details so that not only does the sender appear even the message appears so you can do this and then like notifications to show ensure that all alerts and silent notifications and everything is shown don't want to have the hide content stuff and other things so ensure that these things are done like notifications for lock screen has also been enabled and like all notifications and other things have been done so these things are pretty important so at this point stuff should start working if i tap a message hi you can see like uh, i should get that hi thing coming here there you go i can get that and not only here i should also get it in the lock screen so i will just lock the screen and i will have another hi being sent and you can see that i am getting this i am getting all the messages that i am sending so all of them are now coming on my lock screen as well so this is pretty important at present the phone didn't vibrate because i have set this like vibration to off 
so if i keep the vibration on then the vibration will also happen you can go ahead and check that as well so well today's tutorial was for like whatsapp notifications not coming or not showing up on your android phone same with calls and other things so hopefully after watching this tutorial all of those problems will get sorted you can also try with a small, small mobile restart after doing all those settings but i really think that once the settings have been enabled on your phone uh, on the system level as well as in the app level and you have checked for do not disturb to be turned off as well as any other power saving modes i think this should more or less sort the problem please do subscribe to the channel guys please do share this with your friends and family and if you like the work please please spread the word that's all from my side until next time it's me amnan signing off